Cosmology is the academic discipline that looks at the evolution, the structure and the ultimate fate of the universe. Cosmogony looks at these things as well, but also incorporates the creation beliefs on how the universe formed, where humans came from and how the planets and other celestial objects formed as well. Clever medicine men would walk to the horizon and straight up into the sky to inherit knowledge. And so often stars are described as deceased spirits, as spirit men and various other ancestors, especially in Australian Aboriginal cultures. One of the explanations of how the moon got into the sky was a group of young hunters with their uncle. And he climbed up into a tree to retrieve witchetty grubs. Every time he threw some witchetty grubs down from the tree, the nephews would eat the witchetty grubs and then they would blow them out of their mouth and the tree would grow. This happened time after time. Eventually the nephews dragged the tree from beneath their uncle and he said to be up there in the night sky as the moon. Just imagine for a moment that I was able to snap my fingers and take away the buildings in the background. Keep in mind that people living in a natural environment, all they saw were the trees, the water and the animals. So whatever is on the land is often reflected in the sky as well. So when we look at objects in the night sky, we see, we see kangaroos, we see possums, we see trees, we see rivers and so on. Even though I'm not a person of faith myself, I think it's fundamentally important that we study the cultural and spiritual beliefs of the various cultures throughout our world.